Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm getting ready to share with you what my 2018 goals are and I'm just going to jump right into the video. If you see me looking down, just know that it's because I have the notes here in my phone and I'll jump right into my goals for 2018. So my first goal is to be a lot more consistent with my YouTube channel. I haven't figured out what my uploading schedule will be, but as soon as I figure that out, I'll be sure to let you know and update my banner. Some things that I'll be looking out for is to be a lot more expressive, a lot more vocal, and to express my confidence through the camera. I'd like to be a lot more visible in my industry. Currently, I work in packaging design, but I'd kind of like to make a shift into human-centered design, similar to places like IDEO, Human Scale, or Frog Design. I'd like to create more opportunities, and what I mean by that is to collaborate more with creatives that I know here in New Jersey. I'd like to document my drawing and sketching for a full 365 days. If you don't know, I studied art and design in high school and went ahead and studied industrial design in college. And I just kind of want to get back into the fine art. And if you can see in the back, I have some paintings and drawings behind me. I'd like to work on my speaking. I tend to either mumble, speak too fast, or not speak loud enough. So I'm hoping to work on that in 2018. I'd like to get back to my email list and share with them updates with my designs and the creative services that I offer. I'd also like to learn a little bit more about branding and marketing, offer those as services in the future. My mom knows how to sew and she makes outfits for me whenever I request. I'll sometimes make a sketch and she'll be the one to put everything together. And earlier this year she had a stroke and it just got me thinking more about life and what I'd like to document, keep, be able to look back on. And one of those things is to learn how to sew. When I was a child, she definitely tried to sit me down and teach me how to sew. Instead, I wanted to draw and do other things. And I never really felt that I had much sense of fashion, but I'm hoping to delve into that with her and learn how to sew. And hopefully by the end of 2018, I'll be able to open an Etsy shop specifically for her. And I'll probably be doing the back end um, things like marketing, branding, shipping things out for her through UPS, and however else things take off. Hopefully for 2018. Lastly, I'd like to thank you for stopping by and watching this video. Be sure to like and subscribe and comment below. Let me know what your goals are for 2018. Bye. Hey guys. Whoa. I need to clean my room.